The white paper we're releasing today is about measuring cost versus value in our healthcare system in Canada. Are we really delivering the value for the money we're spending in healthcare? That's really the central question. So really what we found was we looked very carefully at what in fact do Canadians value. We read a lot about values, but really what do they value? And the fundamental findings were they value things like quality of life, health and wellness. They value collaborative partnerships with health provider. So then the question becomes, is that what we're measuring? And is that what health systems are striving for in Canada? And the answer to that question is, not so much. We actually found that there's really almost a nearly complete misalignment between what Canadians really value and, and strive for in their healthcare system and what healthcare systems are actually driving towards. So if Canadians value health, wellness, quality of life, collaborative partnerships with health providers, then we need to really shift and make a transformative change in our health system from one where health systems worry a lot about what services are we providing, how much do they cost, and all our operational features of health systems. We've got to transform and move that shift towards are we delivering on the value proposition that we strive for that fits with Canadian values. So our first recommendation is to make that transformative shift towards, met towards focusing the health systems, not on managing the system, but on delivering value to Canadians and strengthening health and, the well and wellness among Canadians uh, as an outcome of our, our health system. How do we do that as a health system? You can't manage what you don't measure. So the third piece is, if we align our health system with Canadian values, then how do we measure if we're actually achieving our goal? So where our second recommendation is to shift the measures of what our health system outputs are from services or or volume of care that we provide in our hospitals or our community centers and shift it towards what is Canadian outcomes in terms of quality of life, health, wellness, um, managing chronic illness, which is a very, very central outcome of a healthcare system. So shift it towards what are we achieving rather than what are we spending time on. So if I'm a patient and if you happen, and many Canadian women like me, are actually managing the health of their family, their children, and aging parents. So if I'm have, helping my aging mother and my children around health, I'm really looking for a health provider that's gonna w help me do that. Make information accessible, make, give, make sure I've got all the right information to make good decisions, and collaborate with me on what's the best fit for strengthening health and wellness as a family member and as a, a patient myself. So really what we're looking for is, have, is working with health professionals to shift between prescribing, do this, do that, exercise, eat well, do all those good things, to how do I help you make good decisions to strengthen your health and wellness? Because a healthier population is a more economically productive population and the focus needs to be that coaching or that facilitating for helping Canadians achieve health and wellness.